Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. On today's video, I'm going to be talking about um, my Bath and Body Works haul, what I hold during a $5.95 sale. So if you're into that type of stuff and you want to see what I got, then definitely stay tuned. Girl, grab your wine and get comfortable because it was a good sale. So I ordered a few things. So here's to you. Okay. So, I would hold the box up, but it's really heavy, so I'm not going to do that. So, the first thing I ordered was Joy. I got it in the lotion and um, the fragrance mist. Joy is Sugar Snickerdoodle. Y'all, it's not. It's not me. Um, yeah, that's all I'm going to say. I don't like it. So, I will be sending that back. Um, also, I got Christmas cookie. This was highly um, hyped up here on the YouTube. And I fell for the hype. And I should have known that I wasn't going to like this scent. Because this type of scent I don't gravitate to. So, of course, th these two smell very similar. So, I don't like this. I definitely do not like Christmas cookies. So that will be going back. I think in this cell, if you shop early enough, um, the, the scrubs, the scrubs was definitely where it was. Um, by the time I checked out, a lot of the scrubs that I had in my cart was gone. So I had to take what I could get. I actually like this scent, which is, um, Sunshine Mimosa. Yeah, I like this scent. It's a foaming body scrub. Yeah. So, I know I'm going to thoroughly enjoy this. Um, from the men's line, the body spray, I got Noir, which is black cardamom, smoky vanilla, and a hint of musk. Um, this came a little bit leaking, but as you can see, I didn't lose. Oh, you can't see. But I didn't lose that much, but this was leaking. The top was loose. I'm like, I'm fortunate that I didn't really lose a lot of product, but this is aromatherapy stress relief. Um. I live in New York. The fall is upon us. It's going to be getting cold soon. So for them days that I'm not feeling 100% or anybody not feeling 100%, I would think that um, the aromatherapy could help with that. This is a stress relief oil, moisturizing body oil. So that's that. Like I said before, the body scrubs and the, um, and the body butter was where it, where it was at for this cell, in my opinion. And this is um, blueberry extract. Radiant skin butter, glowing. I know that I smelled this a few times in stores and was like, whenever there's a cell, I definitely wanted to get it. And yet, this smells so good, so good. So that's that. Very extra. Um, I'm not a bath person, but I'm not sure if getting this for $5.95 is worth it. But this is um the bath bomb. It's sweet Christmas berry. It smells good. It smells like soap. I don't know what kind of soap. Oh, this reminds me of caress, like a, like the berry, the berry, caress. That's what it smells like to me. So I got that, and I got it in winter candy apple and little bath bomb. I don't take baths, but that's that. I'm a shower person. I take showers. Don't get it twisted. I don't take baths, but I take showers. Okay, so, y'all, for a person that don't take baths, here I am, another bath bomb. And this is in Vanilla Bean Oil, well, one of my favorite scents. But um, I haven't bought it in a while because I've heard after 
2017 or 18 that they may have changed the formula of that fragrance and it's not giving what it's supposed to give so yeah yeah i like this one this is love this is cotton candy and champagne what this smell like i think i like it this is giving me okay initial spray it smells medicinal I'm gonna let that shit dry down because I don't want to be walking around smelling like cherry medicine. That'll go back to. I'm 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 <laughs> I'm not happy with what I got. I'm happy with like the body butters and the scrubs, but these scents like love and snickerdoodles and Christmas cookies. I don't like them. I'm, oh, I sprayed this over um Christmas cookie. I don't like it. All right, so this is a question mark. The um cotton candy and champagne is a question mark for me. I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep these. I wish I didn't spray it under um over snicker um Christmas cookies. I don't like that scent. Period. Period. I don't like that scent. Okay, I got um you're the one. I think we all should know what this smells like by now. And this is the uh lotion. Lotion body butter. Let me see what this look like. What makes it a lotion? Mm, this smells so good. This smells so good. This is very Oh, y'all see that? Y'all see that? See why they call it the lotion. Look at that. That is nice. Oh, hold up, fuck up. Y'all, this shit got glitter in it. Ugh. That's why they call it lotion. Oh, I don't. Mm. What the hell? Yes. Oh no. That's massive. Oh, I, I had no idea. None. Yo, this smells so good. Why it has to have glitter in it? Like, who's gonna wear this all over their body like this? Oh, wow. Yeah, I, I, now I know why they call it lotion, but I had no idea. None. But it's, it smells so good. Oh, look at my hand. Y'all see that? Oh, that's ridiculous. So with that, I don't need this. This is love. The cotton candy and champagne. It seems like all the glitter settles to the bottom. So I don't think this is like this. Cotton candy and champagne diamond mist. That's what this is. Yeah, if I don't keep the um, body mist and lotion, that will be going down. Got my favorite, which is winter candy apple. I love this scent. This is winter red apples, winter rose petal, candy orange, maple leaf, fresh cinnamon. I don't think I smell cinnamon in here, but this, no, no funny shit. Y'all, this reminds me, this scent is so nostalgic for me. Because this right here, it reminds me of the original strawberry champagne from Victoria's Secret. The, remember, now I won't be telling my age, but I'm going to say back, what, I think I was in high school. And the uh, strawberry champagne, like the perfumes to come in this little glass bottle. It was like, kind of shaped like this cylinder. Oh my gosh. While everybody was wearing Love Spell. I was wearing strawberry and champagne, and that's what this reminds me of. Oh, I'm trying to get the cinnamon. I wasn't getting it before, but this is good. I love this. So I got that, and I got the lotion. And oh, 
and I got this. This is Diamond Mist Dahlia Diamond Mist. I was just putting shit in my cart. I don't even know if this is worth $5.95. This is the Vanilla Sugar Ex Exfoliating Lip Scrub. Is this worth $5.95? Like, let me know. So that was that. Now we got to get to my second box. Okay, y'all. Uh, definitely have to take a drink because I done filmed this video multiple times. And I'm happy to do it for you guys. So, here's my second box. In the second box, we have this aromatherapy. This aromatherapy line stress relief and for some reason do I gotta put this in the refrigerator because I've never seen uh oh a sugar a sugar body scrub so liquidy before um I've never seen it I had this sitting around for a while before filming this video and maybe they have too because I've never seen oh lord I'm mercy I don't know if I'm gonna be able to use it because it has some oils in here that I'm allergic to. I think I'm so happy that I'm looking at this and reading the ingredients because this will be going back. I have not opened it. It's very liquidy. It may have settled, but there's oil in here that will break me out, so. That's going back. Yeah, this is like my favorite full scent, so I had to get it in the in the um, shower gel, the fragrance mist, and the lotion. And it is none other than marshmallow pumpkin latte. My favorite scent. I don't wear this outside. I don't want to taint it with you know the environment and day to day stress. So, this is like my cozy time fragrance. So, yeah, that's that. I got Kingdom Heart of Gold. Oh, let me tell you, I don't think I'm going to keep that. This is a beautiful scent. But it reminds me a lot of Dahlia. And I love Dahlia. However, I have Dahlia in the fragrance mist and I have Dahlia in the perfume. This is like a mix of Dahlia and Golden Sunshine. You know, it's this is not an, a necessity for me. I don't need it if it reminds me of Dahlia and I already have Dahlia. Yeah, I, that is going bad. I got Christmas cookie, y'all. Everybody here in the tube been talking about Christmas cookie. So I bit the bullet, got Christmas cookie. I know what I like, but you know, everybody talking about how great this scent is. I don't like it. It's going back. It's not my thing. Period. It's not my thing. And here we have Twisted Peppermint in the shower gel. I'm looking forward to it, uh, using that. I wonder if it, give, if it gives you like a cooling sensation in the shower. Because that's what I was looking for. Which is why I purchased it. And then we have Classic Flannel. Which is fresh bergamot, patchouli spice, and sweet amber. Don't know what this smells like. Let's see. I'm going to spray myself in now. Look, turn. How you, how you use this stuff? Girl, I'm gonna blind myself if I can. Ooh, okay. Uh, 
That smells good. It's sweet. It always says sweet amber. And it was definitely sweet. So that's all I got. And y'all, I'm not happy with this order. Period. I'm, I don't like snickerdoodle, love, love cotton candy, whatever that is. It's a question mark. Christmas cookie. Definitely. Christmas cookie is going back. Um, this is going back. It has some oils in here that I'm allergic to. I, I hate returning stuff. I, I re I'm really a person that do not like returning things, but I'm not going to keep these fragrances and I'm not going to wear them. Initially, I bought them like, okay, I can give them away as gifts but fragrances is so personal you know what i mean so it's hard to um in my opinion give away fragrances because not everybody like the same thing so with that being said i feel like half my order have to be taken back to the store the only thing that i'm keeping is a twisted peppermint um my marshmallow pumpkin latte um i might consider keeping the diamond mist the dahlia um the love one is going back and my scrubs and my body butters y'all that body butter is too glittery it smells so good though but look at all that shimmer i'm so past that stage in my life that I'm not really quite sure how I can maneuver that in my, you know, in my life. Like, when do I wear shimmer, that much shimmer? When would I wear it? Because it's a body butter, so you're supposed to wear it all over your body. So, I'm going to be going wherever I'm going with all that shimmer. I'm a little bit too old for that. So, even though I like the way it smells, I love the way it smells. That one was, um, which one was that one? That one. Yeah. Uh, which one is this one? Yeah, the one. Okay, y'all. Uh, so, I'm about to wash my face and um get cozy watch a movie but i just wanted to say that if you enjoyed this video with all the whatever in it don't forget to like and subscribe y'all i got I'm, I'm a fragrance junkie so i'm about to maybe maybe hmm. before i go to bed i will upload a video and this is not um the video that i'm gonna do is not in this spot it's not one of those videos um with fragrances that are by companies that inspire you know like um you know you know you know what I mean. You know how they have these fragrance companies that make uh, dupes for higher end. No, what I have in my collection is perfumes by perfume designers that actually smells exactly like your favorite fragrance. So what I'm going to need y'all to do is definitely like, definitely um, subscribe. Okay, so that way, and turn your notification on, definitely, so that way you'll know when I upload the video of the perfumes that I have. Because, listen, no one has, there's no inspired fragrance that I'm aware of that has anything that smells like Lancome. But I found me a perfume that smells exactly like 
what may be one of your favorite lamb comb fragrances. So y'all gotta like and subscribe and stay tuned for that. I also found something that smells like um, YSL Libre. And these are not from those um, inspired houses. No, these are perfumes, honey. And I just happened to come up on it. And I want to share with you guys. But I need to know that y'all watching. So go ahead and subscribe. Give your girl a like. And stay tuned for that.